addition to our weekly therapeutic riding classes that we have at Banbury Cross, we also pride ourselves in the fact that we're able to offer our clients um, a few additional activities. We have a large open house and horse show. As you guys are watching our ladies move through this pattern, if you um, are or are not familiar with horses, um, horses really rely a lot on the communication from their rider, especially when it comes to trust. So we have some obstacles in here that might normally be pretty scary to horses, and they wouldn't choose to go over them and encounter them. So as you see, like the blue tarp on the ground, that's kind of scary for horses sometimes. And going over the bridge here that Mo and Elmo just went over, that also could be pretty scary. Um, and the same thing with our logs. So the fact that our horses are willingly listening to their riders is just a great demonstration of what they have achieved with their horses. Open house portion, a great way for individuals who might be interested in learning more about our program. We've got some very different type horses in the ring. Um, we've got Magic, which is a quarter type horse, and Malabar, who is a thoroughbred quarter horse cross, I believe. And we have Cory, who's a draft horse. Um, draft horses were traditionally used to pull and be work horses, but we find that they make excellent therapeutic riding horses. And then we've got a pony, um, Stormy and Sassy, who's also a pony type. So we've got kind of one of everything in this class, which is absolutely awesome. All right, let's have our riders, starting with Max, line up at K, please. We're going to show some of our trotting skills that our riders have been working hard on. For our students to show off the skills that they've been working on all year to their families, their friends, it's a, it's a great fun day. We usually have some vendors here. Um, we have free lunch. Um, and we do rider demonstrations from 9.30 in the morning to 4 in the afternoon. It's a great, fun, family-filled day.